What is MetaMask? MetaMask is a piece of software that makes interacting with any blockchain much, much easier. MetaMask essentially does all the code that you would need to do automatically. All you have to do is press a few buttons. So if you haven't already, you really should watch our What is a Cryptocurrency Wallet video, where we explain what public and private keys are and the different ways to store them. Basically, when you want to send some of your cryptocurrency to someone else, you need to use your private key to stamp that transaction and then send it to servers across the network. Personally, I have no idea how to manually do this, and I have no idea what servers to send it to so that it actually gets on the blockchain. Well, MetaMask specializes in this. They take whatever you want to do and turn it into a click of a button. In most cases, you are interacting with a website such as Uniswap or PancakeSwap or even CryptoKitties. And then MetaMask is the intermediary from those websites to you. They are acting as a security layer as well as an accessibility layer. Nothing can go from your MetaMask wallet to that website that you're on without your permission. So think about it like this. When you go to the store and you want to buy some grapefruit, do you have your credit card number memorized? What about the day that it expires or the security code on the back? No, almost nobody memorizes that because it's a lot easier just to swipe your card or insert your chip and let it do the work. MetaMask is essentially doing the same thing. With your credit card, the numbers are the data and the card itself is the way that you use them. With MetaMask, your private keys are the data and the browser extension is the way that you use them. To show you how simple it is, here's a quick little video of me swapping some BNB for Tether on a decentralized exchange called PancakeSwap and you can see how easy easy it is to do with MetaMask. Just a few button clicks. So moving on, is MetaMask safe? Yes, the MetaMask app is actually very secure and trustworthy. You can be assured that the code source is actually public and it has been audited by very intelligent and curious people. The main vulnerability you might have isn't with MetaMask, but with the computer that you use MetaMask on. For example, if you have a virus and it wants to get into MetaMask, or maybe it logs all of your keystrokes from the keyboard, that way it can tell what you're typing, that would be one of the only ways someone could hack your MetaMask account. And that's not MetaMask's fault. That's your fault for not using a secure computer, if that makes sense. Another way someone could hack your MetaMask data is if you actually downloaded a fake version of MetaMask that was designed to look like the original, but instead actually stole your private keys so that the hacker could have access to your funds. Again, this would be an issue of where you initially installed MetaMask, not a security flaw of the true MetaMask software. One important thing here for the nerds and active viewers of this channel, it should be noted, MetaMask, the company itself does not hold your private keys. In fact, they never send them to their servers. Your private keys and your wallet passwords are always stored locally, only on the machine that you imported them to. This means MetaMask is technically an offline software wallet that you turn on whenever you need to use it. Another thing you should know is that they allow you to create multiple wallets. For example, you just click add a new account and boom, you've got a brand new private key, which is essentially a new wallet address. You might not think this is important, but it's very useful if you want to keep certain funds in different accounts. They also make it very easy to switch back and forth between different private keys. Another big benefit that MetaMask offers is they allow you to connect other wallets. Importing other private keys that you might own is also very simple. For example, let's say that you have a Ledger Nano X and you have an account on there. Maybe you have some Ethereum. However, you set that up a year ago and with the explosion of decentralized applications, you want to move your money from your Ledger to your MetaMask account. That way you can interact with those dApps or decentralized applications. Well, instead of transferring your tokens and coins to a new address and paying those fees, you can just add in your mnemonic phrase and copy and paste your private key and boom, now it's in your MetaMask wallet. Your account is now on your ledger and your MetaMask extension. In short, MetaMask is great at allowing you to create multiple wallet addresses as well as importing wallets that you already have. So this brings us to another very important question. How does MetaMask make money? Because whenever there's a product that works very well, but it doesn't cost anything to you, you know that there's a hidden price. So we did some research and found out exactly how MetaMask makes its money. Because it is a company and it does employ developers. Well, there are two main ways. One is that using MetaMask, you can buy crypto straight to your wallet using a third party. MetaMask makes a very small fee for every buy and sell that happens through its extension. But these small fees add up because they offer a great product and a ton of people are using it. Kind of like how credit cards can charge a transaction fee and through that they can actually offer 
rewards to their customers. So many people are using them that they can afford to offer those rewards. Well, so many people are buying crypto with MetaMask that they can then offer a reliable, trusted product. Secondly, MetaMask allows you to swap tokens, say from Ethereum to basic attention token. Well, they charge a super low fee on that too. And for many newbies of crypto, it's much easier to swap their tokens with the MetaMask browser extension than to go to PancakeSwap, enter the contract address of the token they want to buy, change the slippage of the transaction so it will actually go through, and ensure that the gas fees are high enough that they are reasonably fast. For newbies, it's a lot easier just to do it with the MetaMask extension. Well, MetaMask takes a small fee of that. Essentially, MetaMask makes their money by taking out small fees of buying, selling, and trading using their software. So in short, MetaMask is a software wallet that you can use while browsing the web and interacting with decentralized applications. They can store multiple private keys and can work on different networks such as the Ethereum network and the Binance Smart Chain network. Also, MetaMask is free to download, it's free to use, and it's also safe. That's why it's one of the most popular cryptocurrency wallets out there. We hope that you've enjoyed this video and most of all, we hope that you've learned something. If you found this helpful, please consider clicking that like button and subscribing to reward our hard work in this ever-changing atmosphere. Thank you so much for watching and we hope to see you in the next video.